This video covers planning elements and content selection. First, you want to make sure you know your timeline. Here is the research symposium timeline. This helps you plan and be aware of how much time you have to create a poster. All research symposium posters need to include the following content in the main title area. Poster title, name of student presenter or presenters, education level of the presenters, faculty mentor, and the mentor's department or school. The main content of a research poster includes the introduction, objectives of the research, methodology, the results, and any conclusions. A creative poster includes an introduction, objectives, the process used, and the end results. Creating a mock-up either by drawing on a sheet of paper, using sticky notes, or taping note cards is a good way to, to decide how your content can fit together. Try different configurations to determine the best layout. Deciding what content to pick can seem overwhelming. The best way to pick the most relevant content is to go back to your abstract. Often it will provide text for methodology, discussion, results, and conclusion, as well as give hints of potential charts, graphs, or images. Highlighting text is a quick way to identify sections. From there, identify what content should be included and how you want it presented, such as a chart or an image, a list, etc. Download the poster planning worksheet there is space in the worksheet to create a mock-up and record all of these details you need to keep track of.